Hello, Guido here from blockbuilders.net and today I want to show you how you can transfer your XRP cryptocurrency onto your Ledger. So it doesn't matter if you are using the hardware wallet Ledger Nano S, Ledger Nano S Plus, Ledger Nano X. Um, the process is basically always the same because you are using the Ledger Live app and it basically works the same with every hardware wallet, Ledger hardware wallet that you have. So first of all, if you don't have a Ledger Nano, um, you can use the link down in the description. With that link, you get sometimes special promotions that you can use or special bundles that you can buy. So first of all, the first thing we do is we go into our Ledger Live app and there we click on Add Account. And then you can add your XRP account if you don't have that yet on your Ledger. So we just click Continue then you need to approve that on your device. And just click continue. I already have one. That's why I get a message here. Um, as you can see here, here's mine. Otherwise, you just need to click continue a couple of times and then you have your XRP account on your ledger. Next thing we're going to do is we need an address and where we can, where we can send our XRP to. So in order to do that, we click on our account and then we click on receive. There we choose XRP. And then we need to verify that on our ledger. As you can see here is the address. We just copy the address and we will also see the address on our ledger nano here. Um, that's just a safety measure. So to make sure that no one is tampering with your computer and you will see the same address on your Ledger Nano and in your Ledger Live app. And you need to copy that. Then you can basically approve that here. Okay, and now we go to our wallet. We will do that on Binance here. However, you can use do that on any other exchange X as well and it basically is pretty similar on different exchanges. So next thing we're going to do is we click withdraw and then we just copy our address here. As you can see, it gives you a message about the MIMO. However, um, Ledger Live doesn't use MIMO, so we can click confirm here. So the only thing we need to add is our address here and we don't need to add anything here um, in the MIMO field. So we can leave that blank. And then you can basically withdraw your XRP. And you can, of course, withdraw all of them, or you just say, okay, I want to test it first. And then you start by withdrawing 30, for example. A minimum you need to withdraw 28 XRP. So you can say, okay, I just want to test it and take a small amount and click withdraw. And then you Binance would ask you for your two-factor code, like the Google Authenticator code or a text message they will send you in order to um, authorize that withdrawal. And then it's basically all you have to do and it will be done after that. So then you just need to wait until your XRP arrive at your Ledger account. And that really depends on the cryptocurrency exchange. So when it comes to Binance, for example, sometimes they send the XRP very fast within a few minutes. However, sometimes it can take a few hours until they send your XRP. So don't get nervous if you haven't received it after 30 minutes or so. And you just need to wait longer. And it's different with different exchanges. That's basically all. If you have any questions, please feel free to use the comments down below. And if you find that video helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.